Welcome to Subtle Story Time. Today we're going to be reading a book called Once Upon a Christmas. This book is written by Rosie Greening and Samantha Meredith. I look forward to reading this book with you all today. Now let's get ready for story time. Once Upon a Christmas Once upon a Christmas in the land of far away, the characters were dreaming about gifts for Christmas Day. Cinderella wanted shoes to wear to her next ball. Little Red hoped for a coat. Her cape was old and small. Despite it being Christmas time, something wasn't right. The characters weren't friendly. They would squabble, scream, and fight. Hey, get off my beanstalk. You're sitting in my chair. Our gingerbread house is ruined. Stop stepping on my hair. Oh, no. The characters were heroes in their fairy tales, it's true. But working as a team was something that they couldn't do. Then, that snowy Christmas Eve, the sky began to flash. The sound of jingle bells rang out, and then a giant, what is it, crash. It woke up Sleeping Beauty, who grumbled, keep it down. Jack called from his beanstalk, I think Santa's come to town. Everybody's looking. Everyone rushed over, and they soon saw with dismay, Santa bruised, reindeer confused, and one big broken sleigh. Oh no, they had a crash. Bless my beard, cried Santa. Please help me fix my sleigh. These gifts must be delivered, and tomorrow's Christmas Day. The characters all longed to show what heroes they could be. I'll fix your sleigh. I'll fix your sleigh. No, I will fix it, me. Too many cooks can spoil the broth, and that's what happened here. Every single character tried out their own idea. So as they huffed and pushed and shoved, the sleigh began to wobble. Then very soon, as always, Everyone began to squabble. Oh no, everybody's squabbling. Stop it, called out Santa. I thought you'd save the day, but fighting with each other means you haven't fixed my sleigh. The characters all felt ashamed. Then up stepped Little Red. We can still be heroes, but as a team, she said. And so they all took turns to say their very best idea. Little Red looked pleased and cried. I think the answer's clear. Some porridge here, a beanstalk there. Ready, Wolf, now blow. Yes, the sleigh is hovering. I think that it will go. Santa thanked the characters and went off on his way. By working as a jolly team, they'd all saved Christmas Day. Good job, characters. From then, the land of far away was filled with love and laughter. The characters were friends and they lived happily ever after. The end. Thank you so much for reading Once Upon a Christmas with me. Don't forget to like and subscribe so you know when I'm going to read my next story. Have a beautiful, 